我们我买的那个什么糖药的药也都是这样的都弄好的哈现在这个是这样但是我们这边唯一不同的这不是成药这是都是成衣是自己处方的所以我们科学中药的那个泡的是从台湾进口但是是在这边的药厂做成像这样
我兩個抽油煙咧就唔會話有啲味啊，哦、好所以佢啲呢啲客嚟啲中藥，佢同啲肉包同埋嗰啲隔開曬，同埋呢度有一一出去就就係啦，唔係如果有時有啲味或者啲肉過嚟咧，佢呢個隔係啦，因為有時我哋啲唐人嗰啲味唔講落，佢呢個全部都係啊消毒。全部嗰啲嘢就係 high tech 嗰啲咯，同埋佢自動安裝嘅係全部啲 plastic 消毒真空㗎，咁、哦、咪對個身體好啲咯。因為有時我哋教士嗰啲咧，都有時覺得誒係咪唔唔九個咁呢個咧就好好乾淨㗎啦，係啦，係啦，咁佢哋就有雪櫃喺呢邊，喺邊度要整個好大嘅雪櫃，咁喺嗰度呢個成個咧就係通前通前嗰啲客人喺呢度。唔係嗰個就係坐喺呢邊，咁佢哋就自己睇到出面嗰啲，因為全部都係係係嗰啲係。咁佢個新加坡房，即係話啊，房一房二房三啊，咁嗰個客話嚟佢呢度睇病就好似環遊世界咁。係啦，咁佢就呢度好多啲病房喺曬呢邊啦。咁佢呢度咧就係醫生嗰度休息嘅時間，佢因為佢有好多個醫生，所以呢個咧就係醫生休息嘅。喺呢邊，係啦，咁佢中間咧就全，因為啲肉房咧，誒啲啲體肥嗰啲，佢哋唔中意好乾啊，因為要好硬啊，休息啊嘛，所以佢哋變成用後邊嗰啲全部咧，就係、是、用嗰啲係啊啊 office 啊，全部嗰啲嘢咁咯，所以呢個就係香港，一日日你都去香港，係係呢個係我哋嘅老闆啦，係。哎哎哎哎私隱啊，係咯，係。咁呢個就係 Adam 個 office 啦，咁佢 office 就好靚噶啦。最近酷啊，緊要。多謝多謝，你繼續你。咁因為佢呢度大啦，佢呢度大，佢都有成四千四百尺。咁佢中國人嘅中醫嚟講，佢係算係最近最靚噶啦。因為佢係話，因為佢哋同貓西嚟啲醫院有個。有有個關係啊嘛，咁、嗯、所以管理醫生，佢哋有啲貓生，啲醫生都會過下嚟㗎啦。但係佢啲病人就全部都係 referral 嗰個嚟。誒，唔、呃、係，因為佢嘅申請嘅。唔係佢，唔係佢都有申請，都有 refer， 因為佢醫生好多嘛。哦 ，OK。佢而家咧，但係佢佢而家咧就想同鬼佬醫生、中醫兩個合作向上嚟，咁變成同埋醫院個生長科。咁樣有冇 family doctor 呢啲？誒，佢而家就係誒誒 interview 解啲 family doctor， 即係未有。因為佢都想做到七日，然後廿四小時做個 working 啊，同埋 Chinese and Canadian 就。咁樣嘅話咧就，唔係因為咁樣好啲咯，因為好多啲誒中國醫生就話我冇一定要係同入去就唔係嘅，因為佢哋啲客咧有五十個 percent 都係鬼佬，嚇，所以鬼佬嗰啲就係誒醫院 refer 過嚟，全部都係有咯。咁其實佢係 more open 做另外一個 new world of introduce 嗰個 Chinese medication、meat and east west 咁睇下乜嘢最好用，針灸、用推拿。用 massage 同中藥同埋調整咯，所以佢係同埋有心臟專科，同埋嗰啲誒誒痛症，佢佢都有佢嘅貓生嚟有個心臟專科要過嚟專科嚟㗎，係嗰個心臟專科係好難有㗎。你如果去出邊嗰度咧，你要約每一次都係六個月到九個月，咁啊佢都會一個星期佢哋而家 working on 個調整，所以佢想嚟就係話貓生嚟啲醫生過嚟 ，family doctor 同埋 Chinese 全部。睇下點樣，咁樣同埋對個身體先好啊嘛。如果唔係，我哋之前睇呢個醫院又呢個，等下哇，走到唔知都去咗邊咯。啊，所以佢呢個診所就想咧 ，combine this and this, this and this together。咁你會睇到好多呢啲啊，係都係全部都係啊，啊啊嗰啲啊藥啊房啦，係啦。我有好多啲有外國老友。嗱，我同你講就啦，唔好篤我。誒，我哋係咩？換翻你個，換翻你個，五個花就係遮住。有啲菌咧，佢係去入噶嘛。咁呢個佢係俾咗更加多啲錢，就係做咗一個 coating 落去。變成啲菌你抹佢就係啦，消毒就得噶啦。佢唔會入咗去裏邊咯。因為有時你去醫院或者病房，而家咧個個都好擔擔心話遮住曬或者咩嘢，所以佢係誒做呢個嗰陣咧，我哋對嗰啲誒材料個特別要求，就係話我哋要嗰啲特別醫院用開嘅，就係誒。confirm 下嗰啲菌咧唔會 spread 啊嘛，係啦，所以佢變成佢呢個科就用咗好多好多錢，就因為呢個原因，就而家基本上係同人嗰啲最差嘅人用，係我哋喺醫院啊，全部嗰啲先有用嘅，係係。咁佢呢個咧，佢仲有嗰、那個都係醫生嘅，有時開會， yeah, yeah. 醫生開會，同埋有時醫生佢哋要溝流嗰啲誒啲誒啲病人啲啲 information， 所以佢哋呢個仲有個 sitting area， 咁又係係啦，所以佢其實有兩個 boardroom 㗎。
咁呢度咧，佢哋都可以教睇嘅，乜嘢？因為佢想有啲病人咧，唔係話食藥乜嘢都好，有時都係要運動啊，係咪？佢全部都會敗，咁所以佢而家就想咧，就有啲客佢哋都想 introduction 嗰個啊氣功，同埋睇嘅，因為鬼佬佢哋嚟，佢又有時話哦，我用嗰個中醫醫咧，或者真藥都係唔出邊噶嘛，你自己其實都要調養身體噶嘛。佢佢會整個 regular。不過我 join 唔得，我唔 patient 得我揾。你梗係得啦，我真係得啦，同埋你哋。因為佢就會誒，佢誒佢哋而家咧就整就要誒、呃、整個太極、氣功嗰啲，咁就佢會請下啲師傅嗰啲。咁所以有時啲鬼佬佢就唔係話係中醫西醫，佢都話想用裏邊運動氣功、太極同埋落嚟咁變成，所以佢就有好啲細房啊 private lesson 咁樣啦。佢又唔會話做好多，都係 relax 下咁樣啦。所以佢哋都有特別嗰啲按摩師，咁啊同佢同佢整呢啲。因为你看做针灸了，做这些东西那个产品，这方面的工作，对特别是在治疗某些特特定病人的一些，这方面可以多谈一些。三分钟不是有人来哦。哦，有人在电话里面报信，我自己打。我另外呢，就是通过这种结合，使西医们能够了解中医更多些。那么我们呢，也在借助他们的这个诊断治疗的这个手段呢，使我们的方法呢，能够更有效来治疗病人。那么今天在我们这里开张呢，是把医院的专科医生请到我们这个诊所来。现在有心脏专科，将来很快的就会有痛症专科、有妇科专科、有关节呃关节那个那个那个风湿专科等等等等。同样，我们希望这种结合呢，能够找到最快的、最好的、最有效的方法来治疗我们的病人。这是呃，希望，谢谢。
but I, I used to try and go through them. <laughs> <音><音><音><音><音><音><音> 而且它这个地板是一种特别的地方他那个曾经是因为国内为了推广中医药事业他是想把这个中医带到就是外国的市场
I know who you are. And Ben Cash comes together. Open ceremony. I'm your MC, Tar. Thank you. Now we all know AC 99 Hospital. It is a combination of Chinese and American medicine. Now AC 99 is a very, very special clinic. It is um, the mixture between Eastern medical uh, techniques with Western. Yeah, the acupuncture has been around China for a really long time. It has indeed a long and very rich history in China, and indeed, and finally, it has been brought into the Western countries, and it is now used worldwide. AC 99 诊所里面的设备呢，都是非常的先进的。that's right. The clinic inside is very advanced, so they are prepared for almost most cases that the uh, patients bring in. 还有就整个就是感觉，就给人感觉非常的舒服，因为我看你们的设备啊，整个就感觉就像一个可以去按摩的地方那样子，不是一个医院。That's right. It's a very, very comfortable environment. So at this time, nobody knows better this clinic than Dr. Adam Chan. So we would invite to welcome him on stage to give us a few words. Please give a warm welcome to Dr. Adam Chan. Today is very nervous. Good morning. I have to read. I never read. I never read in the past. <laughs> uh, dear Councillor, uh, Mr. Shi Xiaobang from People's Republic of China, and uh, the three city councillors, Alex Chow, Alan Ho, Mr. Gordon Landon. Gordon Landon is the longest uh, probably uh, city councillor in this uh, Markham area, almost like I came to Canada, 83, somewhere like that. And uh, dear friends, my colleagues, Western medicine colleagues, Eastern medical medicine colleagues, and my friends, and my patients, and my neighbors. Thank you, everyone, to come here for today. And you are coming, you are coming here to help the celebrating the grand opening of this AC99 Health Center, the health care facility. It's very unique. It is unique because well-established hospital-based specialists are working here for our patients. It is unique because under the one roof, the same roof, traditional Chinese medicine and Western medicine practitioners are working together to treat our patients. I have been studying Chinese medicine for over 40 years. <clears throat> and uh, I know that the patients, even with the same general disease condition may need a different solutions. And the best solution varies from patient to patient. For example, for same headache, and patient A may need a couple of uh, Tylenols, and B would need a few of uh, local injections. And the patients C, D, 3 may find that an acupuncture or herbal remedy or massage are the best solution for them. And uh, that all needed for patient F is uh, a nice vacation. <laughs> so a uh, patient need, has a different needs, and uh, each therapeutic method has its distinct, distinct, distinctive value, very nervous. And uh, everyone has its own limitation. On the AC99 Health Center, in this, this place, we have a team, team of uh, practitioners with diverse backgrounds. So we work together, we have advantage. We can quickly find other possible best solution for our patients. And uh, I am very well aware that uh, Chinese medicine is uh, not yet a mainstream healthcare option for general public. 
However, I know for a fact that the Chinese medicine offers many unique benefits and with no detrimental side effects, and it's not invasive. And working together side by side with the Western medicine, the synergic effect is much better than either one work its alone. And it has been revealed in many, many of Asian countries, China and the regions, Korea, Japan, Taiwan. In Canada, we have been working diligently to catch up. So I just mentioned a few steps we've taken. In year 2000, before that, 1997, Canadian had the first uh, acupuncture full comprehensive acupuncture program at a published founded institute. In year 2000, in Monsanto Hospital, that was the first one acupuncture clinic being established in the hospital. And uh, two years later, initially for pain treatment, uh, two years later and in another hospital, St. John's Rehab, and uh, to treat the stroke and uh, the trauma patients. In 19, 2008, we have acupuncture service in the hospital to treating in addition to the pain, the woman's health, including fertility, pregnancy, and menopause, treating the uh, arthritic conditions, rheumatoids, and uh, treating the uh, uh, heart conditions. And uh, at the beginning of this year, medical Tai Chi had the first time being treated as a therapeutic method of being introduced in the hospital. And uh, today, we have integrated health healthcare team working on the one roof, as you witness. So, today we are gathering here to celebrate the opening of this unique integrative healthcare facility. And I'm confident of it tomorrow that many more like this will arise in Canada. And uh, please let me speak a few words in Chinese of my, to my Chinese friends and then I'll come back in English. 谢谢各位来到这里这个老大夫诊所开张这是这个意义很重大那么走过这些路呢他是我们中医界最好的朋友他是第一个把针灸带到医院的这个人他是在曾经是过去的多伦多大学医学院的副院长现在是全加纳或者是全北美这个数一数二的通证中心通证的这个专家我给我三十秒钟的时间我会介
and he is the leading pain specialist in Canada, if not in North America. And he is one of the best friends of traditional Chinese medicine. Ladies and gentlemen, Dr. Alan Gordon. And at this time, we would like to also welcome the friends. Uh, I first met Adam about 10 years ago when he was, uh, he, he was, um, he ran the acupuncture program at the Michigan Institute and he, we had a acupuncture clinic uh, built at Mount Sinai where students were taught uh, acupuncture and where we actually integrated a lot of our cases together. And more recently, Adam's come back uh, and uh, is part of the, our rehab and well-being clinic at, at Mount Sinai Hospital, again with colleagues where they come several days a week to see patients with, uh, with various kinds of problems, particularly pain. So I look upon uh, traditional Chinese medicine, not just acupuncture, but even Tai Chi, because we actually have a, a Tai Chi program that, uh, that, that works at Mount Sinai as well. I look upon it as a normal part of medicine. I, I don't think of any different. I don't think well, I'm going to send to those. Chinese people, I'm actually sent to people who have expertise in certain areas. So I'm a firm believer in, in the benefits of this kind of program. A very, I, I, Adam's talked to him about this uh, new, uh, new uh, program for quite some time, and I've helped advise him on, on, on setup. So I'm really pleased to see what's happened today. It looks like a very good place. Uh, you, you know real estate. One thing, by the way, that always impressed me with Adam was his, his business ability, his business skills, and his like, entrepreneurial so he has, uh, besides his PhD, which he, I think he had molecular biology and his ability to, uh, to do a uh, good brand of medicine, he also has some entrepreneurial skills, which I think are apparent today. So I bring, gre bring greetings. I'm uh, very uh, pleased to be here with some of my other colleagues from Mount Sinai Hospital uh, and elsewhere. And uh, I, I congratulate you on what you've done and look forward to uh, a long-standing association. Thank you. I will give my speech in Mandarin, and second, I will uh, take some uh, English version. Uh,亲爱的,呃,London议员,亲爱的胡议员,亲爱的李议员,呃,陈医生,各位朋友,各位女士们先生们,大家上午好。今天,我很高兴受邀参加AC99老大夫诊所的开业仪式。在此我仅代表多伦多中国总领馆对人们做出了越来越大的贡献表示诚挚的感谢和衷心的祝贺不仅为广大华人朋友和本地的公众带来福音同时也能为中医药事业和西药事业的共同发展做出更大的贡献谢谢 Ladies and gentlemen, good morning. I'm very glad to be invited to attend the AC99 Health Center Grand Opening Ceremony. On behalf of the Chinese Consulate General of Toronto, I want to express my congratulations to Dr. Chen and your team. I believe. <laughs> I 
I believe the AC99 Health Center will be very beneficial to enhance the connection between Chinese and the public of the society and to publicize and popularize the traditional Chinese medicine and acupuncture and to serve the Ontario public health the best. Thank you very much. Uh, mm -hmm. Councillor Alan Hall from Ward 6 and Regional Councillor God Landon from the town of Markham. I want to congratulate Dr. Adam Chen for opening a clinic in the town of Markham. Thank you for your contribution to the Markham economy. I think you have made a wise decision because, as you know, Markham is the most diverse community in all of Canada. I just want to congratulate you to have a continued success. I believe the East and the West medication sooner or later will prosper in Canada. Not long ago, because as a Chinese Canadian, I'm used to Western medication. A couple of months ago, I started to do Chinese medication because I somehow I felt that, you know, like, I mean, if it didn't work out, it's not bad to try out the other one. I don't know whether it is my inner feeling or I started to feel better ever since I took Chinese medication. But anyway, so all the best to your new clinic and wish you success and continued prosperity. I wish a lot of patients is gonna come here and get to know better about the East-West medication. Thank you. Chan. Dr. Alan Gordon, uh, Vice Council Xi, my colleague, uh, Regional Council uh, God Landon, Regional Council Jolie, honored guests, ladies and gentlemen, good morning. On behalf of the Markham Council and, uh, and the Mayor Frank Scabitti, it is my pleasure to be here today. I'm honored to be one of your guests of honor at this grand opening ceremony, and I know this day comes with much pride and dedication. By the way, Mayor Francis uh, Scavidi cannot make it today because he is under the weather. I applaud AC99 Health Center for the creation of the, the state of the art integrated health services to the public. Dr. Adam Chan and Dr. Alan Gordon both with years of traditional Chinese medicine experience and expertise, have been the driving force behind this fabulous new space. This health center will enable conventional and alternative medical practitioners to work under one roof, as Dr. Adam uh, Chen said. I know AC99 Health Center will be the place to deliver the best possible patient care. I'm especially thrilled that this health center is in the town of Markham. Excellent choice of location, congratulations. Markham is often referred to as the most diverse city in Canada. And this new center certainly fits the bill with its teams of healthcare professionals from diverse backgrounds working in collaboration. I wish you all the greatest success in your health center, and thank you for inviting me to join you for this auspicious occasion. Thank you. Now I would like to uh, invite our Michael Lead, uh, Regional, uh, Regional Councillor Scott Landon and Regional Councillor Joe Lee to present uh, the plaque to Dr. Dr. Adam Chan and Dr. Ellen Gordon from the mayor before uh, Regional Council of Scotland speak. Thank you. It's a pleasure to be here and to be at this uh, opening of this integrated um, medical facility which combines Chinese medicine with our, our uh, traditional uh, medicine. I can tell you back uh, um, in 2002, I was uh, in a wheelchair 
and suffering from excruciating pain. And uh, I really didn't know what to do. I went through the traditional medicine and it really wasn't helping. And I did search out some acupuncture and some other Chinese medicines. But what, what was hard at that time was that there wasn't a facility like this one where you, you can come to and have meet the physicians from both sides, the, the ones who are doing Chinese medicine and traditional medicine, and treat you what, with what was appropriate. And I think that's the real advantage of AC99, is it's got a, all of the current Western medicine, but it's also got the Chinese medicine. And that's something that we need badly in our community. Also, I'd like to say that this has become a wonderful campus of health providers, and so if anything you need here, you can find. And the other thing that I'd like to say is, budget chairman, we really welcome AC99 because we're going to get some nice taxes, and we always appreciate that. But the other thing I'll tell you is that we've had three years of no increase in our taxes, and I'm budget chairman, and I sort of think we might do it for four years in a row. No, that's just a scoop. We're working on that right now. So anyway, I'd really like to welcome AC99 to Markham, and I think it'll be a very successful business. Thank and you. To our ribbon cutting ceremony, we would have. <laughs> very shiny scissors. Yeah, she's quite late. So now we would like to ask all the guests. Now our Dr. Adam Chan will do the honor of popping the champagne. Change the champagne. We're at the Just get It fits me very well because I'm shaking. <laughs> Give it a few more shakes. Congratulations. And now we will proceed to our toasting ceremony. <laughs> so for everyone's health, cheers! cheers. cheers. All right, we're, well, guests, please remain for a little more while as we will invite the guests in the second row to proceed onto the front for a few photos. Thank you very much. Now, with the guests in the second row, please return. <laughs> now, this time we would like to uh, have Dr. Alan Gordon and Dr. Adam Chance please remain as we are proceeding towards our a very rich and very prosperous future for AC99 Health Center.
That's right. We wish all the patients that walk out of AC99 Clinic will be as energetic and as joyful as these two lions. Now we. The following time, you guys could come to the front, take photos, and we also prepared some snacks and refreshments for you to enjoy. So right now, on behalf of AC99 Health Center, I would like to thank all the guests for coming today. And on behalf of all the guests, I would like to wish AC99 Health Center a very rich and very successful future.
不感谢所有来宾的到来，我们再一次再次祝福 AC 九九的有个美好的未来。